Hello everyone, it's D-Man here from D-Man's Vids. Welcome back to another video. Today we are in Minecraft and we're going to be taking a look at a redstone tutorial. As if many, if, if anyone's read the redstone handbook, the Minecraft redstone handbook, you will know that there is a project in there called Jebdoor. And if you tried building it in Minecraft, the chances are it won't have worked. And that's very simple. Because There's a very simple reason for that, because the mechanics for pistons in Minecraft there's only, there's one specific thing that makes them work, and that is the bottom piston sensing a block change above it. So when you go to open the door, uh, or turn it on, only half the door will work, unless you're in PC, like I am, where the whole door works. Uh, it's very, very simple. I'll just take away this cobblestone and show you how it works now. When you press the button, all these pistons... Well, this piston fires first, and then the two side. This two side one comes out, so it it extend comes out and extends. Okay, um, and I've set my door up so that it can be operated from either sides using this little toggle flip flop circuit here. So if you say you say you open the door, you run through into your base, hit the door, hit the button again, and the door is closed. Nobody can get in. The door is a slight downside of that circuit, and that means that it can only, and due to the positioning of the redstone block, that means it can only be toggled on again from this side. But I view that as a security feature, and a definite plus. Plus, so if you're in PC edition and you're ready to learn how to do, make a jetstone door, stick around because this is how we're going to do. It. Okay, okay. So we've just jumped out of my uh, testing world and into this. Lovely creative world here, and what I've done is I've found a nice rock face. Well, this one's made out of dirt, but you can use any, you can use any good fear, sheer face. And uh, we've just mined a little hole out of it. This is three by six blocks across and four blocks up. And we're just going to start building our jab door. And again, if you're not on PC edition, this will not work for you. So we're just going to start off by putting a two by two piston in each corner like this. And then putting a piston on the back here, and then just put your block of block of the hill in front, in that little one gap by one gap, and that's all the pistons you need. So you know you can get rid of those. Moving on now to the actual redstone, it's really not very difficult. I'm just using blue wool because it's, the redstone dust shows up very well on it, but it doesn't really doesn't matter what block you use to put your dust on. Line them on each side here. Get your repeater. Now this is very important. The direction of the repeater is very important. If you get the repeater the wrong way around, it will not work at all. Stand in the center of the doorway. Place one there and one there. Set them both to two ticks of delay by right clicking on the repeater. And just put some redstone dust in the center there. And that's really all there is to the jab door. Now just to test it, put a lever on there and flick it and you should see the dirt comes out so that it's flush and all we have to do now is camouflage it 